So we're gonna check out here the Asus P3B projector. Uh, here, the Asus booth. So hello. Hello. So this is a new projector that you're launching right now. Yeah, we're gonna launch uh, by uh, August time frame. August, it's gonna be released. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, what is this? Uh, is it 1280 by 800? Yep. 1280 by 800, and uh, let's look around. Yeah, let me show you. So you have MHL? Yeah, MHL, HDMI, VGA. And we got a multimedia playback function, so you can go through from the uh, memory sticker to the USB Type-A, and also the, the micro SD. And also you can have a cable to your laptop and store your file to the projector, internal memory, directly. Nice, let's, uh, let's connect it to the wall. Sure. Uh, so you have a tripod right here. Uh, can you put it on this? Yeah. Um, uh, oh, there's a hole. Okay. Yeah. You got to allocate stone function. So you allocate stone. So if you point down, then it's automatically ad adjusting the keystone. Yeah, yeah. But not to the sides. No. Can you also do it to the sides? Ah. Can you, this, like this, it doesn't do keystone. Oh, no, no, no. The vertical. Cannot. Vertical. Nobody can do. Uh, what do they have done in the future? Soon. Some have done, yeah. yeah. So how about uh, autofocus? No? No, no. No, no, no. no. Alright, so, uh, so this is DLP. Uh, which DLP are we talking about here? It's a point, uh, point 0.45. Point 0.45? Yeah, the y YSGA resolution. DLP solution. So is it different from previous 1280-800 or is it the same? The same, the same. The same. 1280-800 DLP. Yep. And, uh, uh, so 10,000 or 20,000 hours you can use? Uh, I think uh, 30,000. 30,000 hours? 30,000, yeah. So basically you buy one, you never need to change. It's battery powered, there's a battery inside. How heavy yeah. is this? Uh, How heavy? Uh, I think uh, around seven, 700 grams. 700 grams, so it yeah. has built-in battery for how long? Uh, 12,000 mAh. Can last for three hours or three more. Three hours? Yep. So you can watch a whole movie. Yeah. But if you want three hours, you need to go low in brightness or no? Yeah, yeah, we do. We How low? Yeah. A little bit lower, right? Yeah. So if you show here in the wall, right now, is this three hour or you have to change the brightness for three hours? Yeah, uh, I need to change the, the, the brightness to reach three hours or more. So how you do that? We can see that uh, on the left hand side, uh, we got a two, two hours and 59 minutes. And then it's brighter, uh, one hour and 47 minutes. And even brighter, you can see the difference. So what kind of processor you put in there? Is there a, a menu system running on a Linux, embedded Linux or something? Yeah, Linux system. Yeah. Linux system running on ARM CPU? Uh, no, we don't have ARM. It's not ARM? Yeah, no. Is MIPS? What is it? Something else? Uh, something else. Uh, something I'm not sure else. Something really detailed. Something basic. Yeah. So it's not running Android in the projector? No, no, no Android. No. No Android. No, neither the other one. The other one does? Yeah, the other one will be support an Android USB display. Ah, USB display. So yeah. it's not inside the projector. Yeah. So how much is it going to cost this one? Uh, it will be 649 US dollar without tax. 649? Yeah. So this is... How about the speaker? Is there any chance we can hear some sound? This built-in speaker? Sure, but... Uh, hey, let me, let me show you the radio. Can we put it? Can we put it on here? Uh, and uh, right here you have the same pointing towards the... Just showing some demo. Yeah. What is this showing? Just that it's good for the roof? Yeah, yeah. Pretty good. Before you go to sleep, you can uh, project to the ceiling to enjoy the movie before you go to sleep. Alright, and uh, what is this one showing? And this one is the one that we connect to the next square. Okay. And you can enjoy, enjoy the, the game or the movie directly from the, uh, the YouTube or internet. I can show you the sounds right away. Nice. <clears throat> So this kind of DLP projector. Uh, yeah. So right now we are playing a video. Is there sound? Yeah. Is there any sound here? How, how, is it maximum volume? No. Oh yes. So here we can hear the sound coming out. Is this loud enough to to yeah, listen to mu music it. to movies? Yeah, I can. I can miss it. All right. So there's built-in, but otherwise you can use external speaker by yeah, connecting a sure. uh, USB. Audio all, so you can. Yeah. G support Miracast, something like this. Yep. 
Can you do wireless display? Yeah, we, we have the extra Wi-Fi dongle to plug in to do the web position directly. So and also including the Miracles function as well. On the dongle? Yeah. It's not included the dongle, no? It's extra. Yeah, uh, actually we need the extra dongle, then we have the sound app and sound phone way inside the projector. Enable the APP Wi-Fi projection and Miracles projection. All right, where's your dongle? You have it here? Uh, no, no, we don't no. have that. All right. So, uh, Nice. What is this? Uh, okay. What is this? Uh, and this is our world first one. Enjoy supported USB display. So it's USB display? Yeah. I can show you USB that. USB to uh, USB. Micro USB display. So it's not MHL? Yeah. yeah. Is it MHL or no? No, no, it's not MHL. It's purely the USB display. Right. So how many Android devices have USB display? How many what? Only few Android few no. devices have USB display, no? This is a future tablet. Any tablet that have already Android have devices, uh, Android devices devices. Uh, more than Android uh, 5.0 version or above. And with the micro USB connector inside, you can support the USB display directly. Every device with 5.0? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Cool.